But the next thing Richard asks Andrew is surprisingly direct. Why isn't this in the petrol pumps rather than in the individual cars? Funny enough, they do use catalysts in the oil refining process. It does need to be in, in, in the actual fuel. Andrew's answer is, at best, completely irrelevant. Yes, it's true that industrial oil refining uses catalysts, but that's a world away from what's being claimed here. That catalytic cracking performed at high temperatures and pressures breaks down crude oil into smaller and more useful hydrocarbons. But that process happens inside vast industrial plants, not inside the petrol tank of Richard's Vauxhall Astra. If the presence of this nugget of stupidity actually caused a chemical reaction strong enough to make your petrol more reactive, then you'd be driving a rolling bomb. Uh, miraculously and unsurprisingly, this never seems to happen. So we're left with the same tired refrain. And you won't be surprised to learn. It's a conspiracy.